The best way to analyze a company is to compare its business against its main competitor and the market, specifically the S&P 500. First, we look at growth. Which stock has the highest projected earnings growth for the next five years? We prefer a higher growth rate. The most points are awarded to the highest rate. Second, we look at P-E ratio. Which stock has the least amount of speculation with a lower P-E ratio? We prefer a lower ratio. The most points are given to the lower speculated stock. Third, we look at the 200-day simple moving average. Which stock is trading lower than its SMA 200 the most? We prefer a negative percentage. The most points are given to the worst SMA 200. Fourth, we look at the returns. Which stock is using its assets, cash, and investments most efficiently? We prefer a higher combined return. The most points are awarded to the most efficient business. Fifth, we look at dividends. Which stock pays you the most to hold their shares? We prefer a higher yield. The most points are awarded to the stock that pays you the most. Sixth, we look at the short float. Which stock are investors and traders most bearish in? We prefer a stock that's least shorted. The most points are given to the least shorted stock. Seventh, we look at the profit margins. Which stock generates the most profits from its business? We prefer a stock that keeps most of its earnings. The most points are awarded to the more profitable business. Eighth, we look at analyst recommendations. Which stock do Wall Street analysts favor the most? We prefer a stock that has a strong buy consensus. The most points are given to the stock closest to a 1 rating. After analyzing and counting the point totals of the 8 business metrics, here you see the final tally for the 3 stocks. The most important thing is to compare the company with the S&P 500. At any case, the higher the score, the better the business. Before we get to the fair price, join my Patreon. You'll get access to every company I've analyzed. It's updated all the time. Go to patreon.com forward slash growth shares or click on the link in the description. Here's the current stock price, along with the company's fair price. So we can figure things out quickly. The big percentage number on the screen is basically how undervalued or overvalued the stock is relative to its fair price. The more positive the percentage, the more undervalued the stock is right now. And then there's performance. Sometimes you just want to know if the stock has performed well enough versus its industry and the S&P 500 during multiple periods. In some cases, you just want to know if your investment can beat the market. And that's another way to analyze a company. Don't forget to subscribe for more. Invest wisely. And as always, take care of your money.